This village warehouse near Basel is the trapdoor to a hidden underground world. Tons of pesticides, solvents, dyes and other heavy metals were all dumped beneath the surface in the 1960s and 70s by Switzerland's pharmaceutical and chemical industries. At the time, there were no rules to stop them. But now, 34 years after the dump was closed down, the authorities have decided to dig up and reprocess the toxic waste. We're going to be extracting 160 tonnes a day. The waste will be loaded onto five or six trucks and transported to Germany. The process will take four or five years. Then after that, the site will be inspected over a further four or five years to see whether we've managed to successfully remove all the hazardous material. A delicate operation, as the excavation zone will have to be completely sealed off in order to prevent the release of any toxic gases into the atmosphere. Nobody will be allowed inside the zone unless they're with a specially trained expert. They'll also have to wear protective clothing so there's no risk of contamination. The project, financed by local polluters, is due to cost some 245 million euros a price worth paying as far as villagers in Bonfol are concerned. The authorities have always insisted the land is not dangerous, but they'll no doubt be happier when it's a pollution-free zone.